sum versus any. Sum and any are both determiners. They are used to talk about indefinite quantities or numbers when the exact quantity or number is not important. As a general rule, we use sum for positive statements and any for questions and negative statements. For example, I asked the teacher if he could give me some paper. I said, excuse me, have you got any paper? Unfortunately, he didn't have any. In the first sentence, we use some because it is a positive statement. In the second sentence, we use any because it is a question. Finally, we use any again because it is a negative statement. Be aware that sometimes you can use some in questions and any in positive statements. This is done when making an offer or a request, or to encourage the person you are speaking to. For example, would you mind buying some ice cream while you're at the store? You can also use any in a positive statement if it comes after a word whose meaning is negative or limiting, such as here. A. She gave me some bad advice. B. Really, she rarely gives any bad advice. I hope this clears up any confusion you might have. That's it for today. See you next time.